cloud. When I was little, my mummy took me to a big, big shopping centre. Willie came too. Mummy gave me some money. Well, let's see what I've got in my hand. <gasps> Choose something to buy, she said. A shiny penny, so you can spend that on something. There were lots and lots of shops in the shopping centre. I didn't know what to choose. Let's not spend it too quickly though, let's see what else we can see. In the shopping centre, oh, there was a lady goodness. painting faces. She painted a little boy to look like a cat. Mummy said, why not spend your money on a painty face? No, I said. I didn't want to look like a cat. High above all the people rushing, I saw balloons. Here we go. I want to buy a balloon, I said. Hi. Let's go and find them, said Mummy. <gasps> oh, look, Tig! A man was holding the balloons. Isn't he funny, said Mummy. He's a clown. I didn't think the clown was funny. The clown was scary. He had a big rubbery face and a red nose. I didn't like the scary clown. I want to go home, I said. Come on, said Mummy. Let's have something to eat. Whee! I like the cafe. There is no clown. Mummy bought me fish fingers. Mm. Would you like some ketchup? I had tomato sauce. Down below I saw the clown. The clown looked up and waved. I don't like clowns. Hey Tig, you don't have to like clowns. Clowns are just people with painty faces. Anybody can be a clown. You could be a clown. I could be a clown. Some people think clowns are scary. Some people think clowns are funny. <laughs> Look, that painty faced clown is making everyone laugh. Hey Tig, why don't you be a painty faced clown and make everyone laugh too? Go for it, Tig. Yes, I thought. I want to be a painty face clown too. Let's go. I finished my fish fingers. I asked Mummy if I could give my money to the face painting lady. The face painting lady painted my face like a clown. Oh wow, hey. that's so sparkly. I think you're a very funny clown. Thank you very much. Mummy laughed and everyone laughed when they saw me looking like a painty face clown. <laughs> <laughs> I saw the clown. He wasn't scary. He looked just like me. The clown gave me a balloon. When the clown saw Willy, he was scared. <laughs> He's only my toy spider, I said. I like clowns. I love Willy. When I was little, me and my friend Timmy went to visit a castle. Willie came too. Daddy knocked on the door, but no one answered. Oops, I think you got the wrong time. We'll come back later, let's go and have a wee play, come on. The castle's closed. We have to wait. The castle had a big tall tower. Up there is the castle tower. Yeah, soldiers used to be up there. That tower's for soldiers, said Timmy. Timmy marched like a soldier, and I copied him. 
time to march into the castle, said Daddy. A man opened the door for us. Hello, can we come into the castle? Uh, yes, please come inside, yes. Come on then, thank you. Inside the castle, it was empty, just walls. It smelt funny. And this is, I see the fireplace. The fire would rise and smoke would come out the chimney up there. Be careful on the steps. Timmy found a little room. It was a friendly little room with cupboards on the wall. I wonder what's in this door. I like the little friendly room. Look, there's a wee window, right? Can we go up the tower, please? Can we go up the tower? Said Timmy. Of course, said Daddy. Timmy opens a big door. Ooh. I heard a woo. I didn't like the woo. Daddy said the woo was Timmy. It's just an echo, OK? Don't be scared. I didn't like the echo. I was frightened. I ran back to the little friendly room. Hey, Tig, new things can be scary and strange. And there's lots of new strange things in a big old castle like this. Strange smells, strange rooms and strange sounds. Hey, Tig, that woo sounded strange. That woo sounded scary. Woo! But that woo was just Timmy having fun. In a big old empty castle like this, sounds sound different because they echo. Cooey! It sounds like someone is copying me. No one's copying me. That's just my echo sound. I made it. And you can have fun making echoes too. Woo! 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 So go for it, Tig. There's no woos behind that door, only the woos that you and Timmy make. Yes, I thought. No need to be scared. Just silly echoes. Come on. I wanted to go up the tower. Daddy opened the door into the woo room. There were no woos. And so me and Sammy had fun making woos. We made lots of other echo sounds. Hello! Then Daddy took us up the tower. We went up some tiny stairs that went round and round and up and up. At the top of the stairs was the top of the tower. Timmy marched round the tower. When Timmy saw Wooly, ah! he was a scaredy woo. It's only a toy spider. I like the old castle. I like funny woos. I love Wooly. One step at a time. When I was little, my daddy took me to buy some eggs. Hi, Dada. This is Wooly. Oh, I love Wooly. We didn't go to the shops. We went a long, long way away to the country. Wooly. Go and get Wooly. Wooly came too. In the country, we went through a gate. We walked through some long grass. Oh, this is exciting, isn't it? We walked down a long, long lane. The long, long lane was very smelly. Stinky. What's that smell, Daddy? I think it's a cow. I wanted to see the cow. I've never seen a real cow before. I think the cows are busy. Busy mooing, I said. At the end of the lane, we saw a scarecrow. Scarecrow! Oh, what's he missing? Big hat. He put the scarecrow's hat on. Whoa, look at that hat. What do you think? Look. It's put him on his shoulder. 
Oh. Lily liked the scarecrow. <laughs> I want to see the cow. I want to see the cow. No, we need to go and get eggs first. Daddy said no, we had to get the eggs. We came to a farm. I knocked on the door. Oh, well done. A giggly farmer opened the door. Hello. Hello. I just wanted to get the eggs to see. You come to get some eggs? Yeah, we better go and see the chickens then. OK. Come on, come on. The giggly farmer took us to see the chickens. I wanted to see the cow. The chicken played some eggs for me and Daddy. We put them into a box. I picked them up and counted them. That was good, wasn't it? Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. It's a pleasure. Oh, there you go. Bye-bye, Farmer Giggly. The long, long lane was very smelly. Come on, Tig. I want to see the cow. Moo! Oh, what's that? A big animal was looking at us. I don't like the big animal. There's nothing to be scared of. It's all right. It's only a cow, said Daddy. Don't like cows. Too big. Come on. It's quite safe. It's behind a gate. Not past the cow, I said. Come on, we need to get home. No. Why not try it one step at a time? Wooly whispered. Tig, one step at a time, it's easy. OK, you go. <laughs> Tig, one step at a time, like Grandmother's footsteps. Come on, creep up on me. Saw you! the cow. You passed the cow, he said. Should we show the cow, Willie? <laughs> Look, Willie. Funny cow. <laughs> Silly cow. It's only my toy spider. Oh. Bye. Hey. Come on then. Home now, said Daddy. Yeah. Come on then. I like cows. And I love Willie. Hey, Willie. Shadows. When I was little, I didn't like the dark. Willie didn't like the dark either. So Daddy bought me my very own light. The light came in a box. A lamp. A lamp. Oh, that looks lovely, Ty. Should we go and set it up? Yeah, why don't we go and plug it in in your bedroom? Let's see what your new lamp is. Daddy okay. plugged the light in. Then we turn the light on. Turn it off. On, and then off again. Mummy, can I make something with the box? the box? I like the box that the light came in. Mummy said I can make something with the box. I made a puppet show. I painted inside the box. I didn't have puppets for my puppet show. When Mummy finished her work, she made me puppet birds. The birds were so sweet. She had little beaks and feather wings. Tig? The puppet birds could fly. Isn't they their friends? No, brother and sister. Oh, that's nice. At bedtime, I switched on my new light. Daddy and Mummy came to see my puppet show. Hey, little Jackie birds sitting on the wall. The puppet show was all about two birds who sat on the wall. The birds flew away and then came back. Come back, Tweety. Daddy and Mummy liked the puppet show. I snuggled down with Wooly. 
And all your lights will stay on until you fall asleep. Mummy left my new light on. Mummy left the big light on too. Then I went to sleep. That night I woke up. All the lights were off, but my very own light was on. It glowed. I felt safe. But when I looked up at the ceiling, something was new. I saw hairy monsters. I hid under the bedclothes. I peeped out. The hairy monsters were still there. I wanted to run away. Hey, Tig, things can look scary at night because things can look different. The light and the dark play tricks. You just need to look again to find out what something really is. So I wonder what those hairy monsters could be. Let's peep. There's your new light. And look. Just above the new light is your fluffy sheep mobile. And over there is... Oops! Big hairy monsters! Round and round they go, just like the sheep. Because that's what the hairy monsters are. Just the shadows of fluffy sheep. So nothing scary, just shadows. You can make shadows too, Tig. You can make your very own shadow puppet show. Go for it, Tig. No more scaries. Yes, I thought. No monsters, just shadows. I'll have fun making my own shadow puppet show. Mummy and Daddy came to see what I was doing. When they saw a big hairy monster with eight legs. Walking across the ceiling, they went. Oh. Ah! There's a little guy spider on the roof. I like my new light. What's this take? I like making shadow puppet shows. I love Willy. 